Hi, I'm Abby. Welcome to my New York City kitchen where today we're making low FODMAP tacos. So what is low FODMAP? Essentially, it is a diet that many people are required to follow if they have certain GI issues or distress. And it's an elimination diet. So each item in that name, FODMAP, stands for a different something that is in different types of food. So for example, F is for fructose. So what I've done today is made a homemade low FODMAP taco seasoning, and we're gonna be able to have tacos with foods that are low FODMAP. So first, let's talk about our taco seasoning. In there I have chili powder, cumin, dried oregano, salt, and pepper. Unfortunately, oh, and some paprika's in there too, right? We're allowed to have paprika on low FODMAP. So unfortunately, the garlic, the onion, is not available when we are doing low FODMAP, but this mixture is still super delicious. So we're gonna do it with some nice lean ground beef. You could also use ground turkey or ground chicken. The first thing I'm gonna do is turn on the heat for my high-sided saute pan. We wanna make sure our pan gets hot. So we're gonna essentially cook our beef with our spices and then we'll talk about some of the other parts of our low FODMAP taco meal. So it's hot. You could add a little oil in the pan if you like. You actually don't necessarily have to because there will be some fat that is with the meat that we're cooking and we're gonna deglaze the pan with some liquid. So we'll get all that good stuff. So in goes the meat. We're just gonna break it up. over a medium to medium high temperature. Then we're gonna add in our spices. We're just gonna put them all in there. And we're gonna mix those around too. So we're gonna essentially also cook our spices, which is called blooming. And the cooking of the spices helps the essential oils that are in those spices to develop, the flavors to develop giving everything a little more depth. So, we're gonna mix this around, around just a little bit more and then we're gonna let it cook and we're gonna talk about some of our other items here. Okay. Perfect. So we're just gonna put this here. We're gonna let this cook and we're gonna talk about some of the other things here. So you may be very used to having things like peppers and onions in your tacos or your um, fajitas. Unfortunately, those items are high FODMAP, so we can't eat them on a low FODMAP diet. But what we can have is that romaine lettuce and some olives. These are a low FODMAP food. Um, these are both really great choices. It'll add some nice crunch, some nice texture, some nice flavor to your low FODMAP tacos. And then of course we are allowed to have cheese. I have some shredded cheddar cheese here. You can buy it pre-shredded, but I often like to get a block of cheddar cheese and then you can use a grater to grate it yourself. Or if you have a food processor with that shredder on it, you turn that on, it's good to go, super fast. Then we do need gluten-free tortillas. So these are corn gluten-free tortillas, and I'm gonna show you a little trick about how to heat them up. There are two options. One is you can take your corn tortillas and a damp paper towel and wrap them, and then just put them in the microwave for about 30 to 45 seconds. They'll heat right up and be nice and pliable. Another method which I enjoy is we're gonna set these right on our gas burner. So I'll do that when we're done with our beef. So let's take a look and see how that's doing. You can see it's cooking really fast, really nicely here. We're just gonna break it up a little bit more. And if you notice, there is some fat 
coming out, which is normal since we're cooking meat. This was a lean cut, about 93%, which is great. So not too much fat. So here comes our next trick. I have some water. I'm gonna add some water in here and we're deglazing the pan. So essentially, what that liquid does is it starts to boil and it helps us scrape up all of the delicious flavor that's stuck to the bottom of our pan. So you can see here how I am able to get all of that delicious flavor from those spices we added into the beef. So we're just gonna cook it over high heat a little bit more. So all this beef now, the pink is gone, it's fully cooked through. And we just wanna cook off some of the liquid that we just added and it'll concentrate really nicely down into that beef. And then I'm gonna move the beef out of the way and we're gonna do our tortillas. All right. Excellent. So I'm going to turn that off. I'm going to move it to the back here. We're going to keep our burner on, actually. And I'm going to get some tongs. And we're going to take our corn tortilla here and put it right onto the burner. And then we'll put it on our plate. So you can see it's starting to soften a little bit. And we can actually even we want to make it in more of a taco shell, we can do that too. Okay, here are our two taco shells. Then we're just gonna put some meat in there. And of course, Beautiful romaine and some of those olives and some cheese. Yum! Delicious. So tacos are a little bit messy and that's totally fine because messy can be delicious, right? So once again, I'm Abby. These are my low FODMAP tacos. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye.